Hey guys, and welcome to my channel, Kels Mache here, and today's video is a clean with me video. This is the first cleaning video in our new house. Super excited. So first, I'm just going to take you on an overview of the kitchen and show you how messy it is. Um, this was after a night that we had some friends over and my sisters and brother-in-laws over hanging out, playing some games. So naturally, with people being over, comes a big mess to clean. getting the dishwasher all loaded up I like to go ahead and knock out any bigger dishes or just any dishes in general that did not fit into the dishwasher once that is done then I like to give the sink a nice deep clean before moving on to wiping down the counters and sweeping the kitchen
Moving on into the living room, um, you can see that my son has clearly destroyed the living room and his bedroom by pulling out all the toys, all the books, all of that fun stuff. So I give you an overview of the mess that I'm working with and then I get started on all the cleaning. So my original plan was to get started on picking up the living room, getting all the toys that go into my son's room in a basket to take in there. However, I got started on that and my son had other plans for his toys. So I decided to go ahead and move into his bedroom where I could shut the door and get everything nice, clean, and organized without him interrupting the cleaning. For his bookshelf, I like to organize the books based on height. He doesn't quite have enough books at the moment to be able to organize by the colors of the rainbow or that is what I would prefer to do. Um, so what you're seeing here is me just going through and organizing all the books based on their height and getting them relocated on the shelf and just makes it look nice and neat and organized. So as you can see, my son does have a lot of toys. Um, we did just move into this house, so we're still working on organization and trying to figure out where we want the toys located and how we want the toys to be organized and put away. So at the moment, I'm just going to keep all the toys that we have, but I do have plans of relocating things, maybe trying to come up with a new organization system for his toys, and then ultimately getting rid of some of the things that he doesn't need or doesn't play with often. So after I was done cleaning my son's room and got everything vacuumed, we were able to put my son to bed so that I could finish cleaning the living room without any distractions or without him pulling out any of the toys. So this just made things a lot more simple for me. 